What is going on guys? My name is Ron Beck and from Ron Reviews here with another episode reaction to Darwin's game. I don't know if hold on let me see okay so it's not a longer episode so i was assuming that we were going to be getting a lot uh all the episodes are going to be long but it's not i think there's only going to only be 11 episodes of the season of the series i believe with the first one technically being two episodes and one i mean it was a 45 minute episode i'm a little bit glad that it's not as long as as the other one because i don't want to have a lot of stuff i gotta be doing today um and same thing with flashback fridays i mean i have one video done um i don't know if you want me to upload it it's quite old but yeah i don't know like it's one of two so if i upload it it's gonna be missing a part but yeah um i have a lot of things i had to be, had to be doing today this is my first day off and even then i don't have that much time to do things because I've been sleeping most of the entire day to catch up on sleep. Uh, but I know you guys aren't really into what my personal life is. But yes, this is episode 2 of Darwin's Game. I know a lot of people have been very um, critical on the series. I know a lot of people are saying that it is. it seems very... Um, it seems very... Cliché. And I agree that... I will agree with that sentiment if at the last at the last like what maybe five minutes of the episode when he wakes up uh, with the chick who, and and it's gonna take me a little bit while to get used to all the uh, all the names it's always that's with every single unless it's like an English dub um, it's harder for me to like immediately catch on to the names and even with the English dubs it's the same way um, because I just it's me just getting used to all the names so but yeah he woke up with a chick and was like have my have my family. Um, or make me a family or something like, along those lines, or was it was like, <laughs> um, let me have your babies or something like that. I, I don't remember, but it was like, it was, it was a cliche. I think it was like, let's start a family. Um, but uh, with the exception of that, I would say the show isn't actually as cliche as it seems like. I mean, it's not bad. Um, but for a first, as, as like the first show that I've been watching of this new deck, it's not bad. Um, is it a little bit? Is it a little bit too generic? I can kind of see where you would get that. But I mean, I mean, generic, just because something's generic doesn't always mean it's going to be bad. I mean, if you think about it, Demon Slayer is a very generic term or um, series that is spiced up with a bunch of other things. If you think about it, like, and the the topic of Demon Slayer is a guy tries to save his sister by d defeating demons and going after the big boss. It's a generic um it's a generic plot, but it's the every it's everything else that makes it as amazing as I think Demon Slayer is. So who knows? Maybe Darwin's game is going to get that again. Um, I was recommended the sh uh, the light novel, or uh, yeah, I was recommended the light novel a long time ago, and yeah. But without further ado, I know I've been rambling on for too much. But this is episode two of Darwin's game, Gemstone Mine. Starting in three, two, one. Let's jam. If I can press play. Aniplex. Aniplex is also known to like copyright claim a lot of people, so. Main reason why I have, you know, this whole setup. Joeyfish. Oh. We're going straight into this. That's why I have pajamas. <laughs> I have babies. Oh. Okay. 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 I, okay. That's a little bit better. There's only one thing you would actually mean if you're naked. I'm guessing intro? Okay, intros. I am going to have to um, mute the intro, as per usual. Also, I'm going to lower this a little bit because I had recently changed monitors. Um, like You guys can see it now, but my old monitor has gone up, got a brand new monitor. It's a lot bigger. Um, and, hold on, let me just increase my gain. My gain's a little bit low, hold on. There we go. That should be a little bit, is that, hold on. Mm. Is this better? No. 
Okay, hold on. Possibly. There we go. All right. Sorry, I'm just increasing my levels. Um, I totally lost my train of thought. Oh, yeah, yeah, the monitors. I got a bigger monitor, a much bigger monitor. And so my old one's, like, retired. And now I'm rocking this big-ass monitor right here. And then my old monitor, which was originally my primary, is now over here. Which is actually kind of good because my new monitor actually um, looks a lot cleaner. And I can see things a lot better. <laughs> Because I used my old, old monitor, um, my older monitor, the one that I replaced, to be the one where I would actually watch the majority of my reactions of the shows. In fact, all of them. I just realized. My light is a little bit too... There we go. That should be better. shelter mm. so he would be able to hide for four weeks oh damn so she was a hide oh okay You know, about creating the whole family thing. She's kind of, like, forced to be by her side now. B blush. Yeah, you should probably start with something first. She's a little bit bashful. It's kind of interesting. Very interesting. Yeah, there has to be another, um, thing to this. Fifty thousand. Damn. Ten points equals that much? Okay. Uh oh, is it gonna uh encounter? Is that like a loot box? Are we loot boxing? Are we EA? Are we EA in here? So I'm listening to this is a death match. Damn. Okay. Okay, it's not. No. So they're actually so they're two different ones that are practicing. Okay. 
again, and she just disappeared. Are we going to have the Nya as a uh, recurring thing? Oh, hey, Hachi. Yes. Oh, never mind. Oh, kind of like how that was. I wonder if there's another place you go after you teleport. Maybe. That would be interesting. That's where all the little guys who died, right? Yeah. Mm. Creeper. Is it going to be one of those shrouded in mystery kind of things? Well, that's going to be a plot point later on, I'm assuming. Of course. Yeah, they do. I do apologize for like not talking much. There's not really much happening right now, but yeah, we'll see. There's always more, you know. It's gonna be ridiculously expensive, huh? <laughs> oh, that's got- yep, I was about to say, that's gotta be that chick. So she's like the information broker. Treasure hunt invitation. Uh, 
if you think about it, he won't need to, he won't really need this. He can just manifest anything he wants. Or does it have to be something he's seen? Like he's actually seen him like in real world. I'm a little bit curious as the uh, limitations on his actual power though. Danger zone. Might want to look to your left, you know, just like, you know, just mind it. Mm. Are you trustworthy, though? That's right, he can spend all those points. Yeah, because he won't tell when he's... Yeah. It's gonna attack... Yeah, because I couldn't just grab it back, because like I said, it's he's remaking something, so. <laughs> Panda prick. Interesting. Yeah, no. All right, so what's going to happen? Yeah, it's not really trained physically, if you think about it. Yeah, I was just wondering, where the hell is Shuka in this entire thing? The analysis is... Hmm... Oh, yeah, about the, about the whole, um, statue situation. So, it seems you can win battles without killing the other person. I wonder why. Changes, uh, change her a little bit. Demeanor is slightly 
quite a pretty quick land that one. So I'm guessing he's a B rank. I mean, technically they're not. Oh, we got the phone. Nice. So what is a sigil? Super fast? Nah. So on one. Wait, what is underneath? What's underneath him? Does is that a sigil? Hold on. I saw something underneath this. He's a first year. <laughs> so he doesn't he doesn't want to be So it only gets, so it does get sent out to only certain people. Maybe it's like certain people in the direct area or in just in general. So I'm still wondering what's underneath this shirt. It doesn't look like a t-shirt. Maybe someone is a Maybe someone is the treasure. What if he's the treasure? Oh. It's a full teleportation. Oh jeez. Yeah, that was a, that was instant. Get a bad feeling about this. Oh, she got teleported too. Did they get erased? Oh, shit. And people are going to fight for the rings. Is that Wang? Yeah, it is. You're dead. You're dead. Yeah, no. That's not how this works. Yeah, 
Yeah, you weren't gonna last that long. <laughs> oh, ending. Ending theme. Alright. Let's hear this ending theme. Okay. So... I don't know. I'm really... I want to see more of this, like I said. But... We know that this Wang dude is going to be the main antagonist of the entire show. Um, they basically set that up after the first episode. Um, hmm. You know, actually, let me hear let me hear the song. I'm just going to turn off my uh, desktop audio. I can't tell if that's a guy or not. And that dude also reminds me of that one. Uh, like, he kind of reminds me of that dude from, um, uh, freaking Sword Art Online Alternative. I'm hoping that's a guy, a girl, by the way. The one with the cat hoodie. Ignition. Okay. So, yeah, this episode was um, definitely more of a setup episode. Um, nothing really major happened. We got to see that other dude um, who was fighting him in the boxing club, so he was very physical, physically active in that whole sense. Um, I'm not sure what else to believe, think about this show, in all honesty. Like, I'm really hoping that it picks up multiple times not like it has slow parts it depends i mean like we were introduced to a little bit of the analyst the first episode and got to know a little bit more about her this and not really actually i take that back we just got to see see more of her not really learn more about her um so i am curious as to seeing what's going to happen with that whole fiasco or uh thing uh and i'm, I'm still curious as to see what's gonna happen with what's it called um like, who that guy is, what his sigil is, the guy who was fighting him as well, um, and how many people are going to die, because only 300, there were only 300 players, one person's already dead, um, and I wonder how many rings are distributed, um, and where you can find these rings, if they're just hidden throughout the town, and wherever, who knows, but we'll see what happens, but, yeah, that's the second episode of Darwin's Game, um, I still prefer the first episode, uh, but yeah, let me know what you guys thought in the comment section below. There really wasn't much to talk about, so I was really quiet for the majority of the reaction, so I do apologize for that, but there really wasn't much for me to speak on. Normally, if I speak on something, I'll know what to talk about, but yeah, anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this episode reaction. Let me know what you guys thought in the comment section below, and I will see you guys next time. See ya.